Because <laughs> it's the only thing you can stay out of second. Hey friends, welcome to episode 63 of Dub Life. Is that correct? 63? Let me consult my documents, huh? My documents got a first name. It's documents. And by documents, I mean the phone. 63 of Dub Life. In a rare occurrence where I am starting the new episode the same day that I ended the new episode. I ended the new episode about six hours ago. I got done most of my errands. But a bit of information has come to me that made me want to start the episode today instead of tomorrow. Uh, I do have James's birthday and Christmas present here in the pinky bag, but that's not till tomorrow. Today, something different. Real quick, we'll check in with the friends. I've just fed them. I filmed the Fish Friday, and it was an excellent one, I think. I have to edit it. But everybody's active. You can see Valkyrie the Shrimp there is having a good time. The Asgardians are on the ground eating things up. Loki is swimming around. Road Worn Thor is swimming around. The coral looks good. Aquarium is looking good. I was really sad when Thor died, but feeling better about it now. And I especially love Valkyrie the Shrimp. Watching her just run around and do her thing. Okay, I'm going to grab dinner and then we've got a surprise. If you want to call me, baby, just go ahead now. And it's nighttime. You can't see me singing, but go ahead now. Shake it up. You see all this congestion here? Do you remember when I complained several months ago about a bridge being shut down for six months and then another one was going to be shut down for six months? Well, we're almost there. Next week, they are shutting the other one down, which means that this now becomes the thoroughfare and the other thing is blocked off. And this doesn't have a light, but it has a temporary light that's set up back there. And the temporary light has one side blinking yellow lights and the other side blinking red lights. And nobody has a clue what to do. Therefore, this thing is just backed up for like a mile or longer. Disaster! I got my first real six string. Bought it at the five and dime. I hate bridge closures, yeah. But since your dad walked out, your mom could use a guy like me. It really is gonna stink with the other bridge closed. I mean that, it's like 6.15 and that's backed up. It's been backed up for over an hour. Do you remember last episode I got the replacement ring light from the UPS store? Well, it had a return label. So I'm back at the UPS store, even though it's really just six, seven hours later. Right before they close, they close at 6.30. All these cars are just staring at each other, except for that truck who's just gonna go. And I'm gonna go. I had to drop this off or turn it back to ring. And then I want to go get some Papa Jacks and then the surprise. That is going to stink though. I got to try not to be negative with the bridge closure. Rub it. Give me that Papa Jacks. I don't want Papa John's. I want Papa Jacks. Give it to me. Give it to me in my belly. I'm super busy. What time is it? 6.27. Ooh, lasagna. Fried pork chops. That's what I want. Pork chops. Is that, is that enough to get? Whatever you want. Oh yeah, you just already know. I got the green beans and the macaroni cheese and the big biscuit that's like the size of a fist and the pork chops with gravy. I'm not eating today at all. I am looking forward to this. This is just not, not terribly busy. I think they got a private event in the other room. Oh, no, give it to me. I think this may be the first time that I've got the uh, light gravy on the pork chop. Here's I just get them plain. It's a good choice. Mm-hmm. That was delicious. Now off to the surprise. I've got three videos to edit tonight too. Oh! Oh! The <laughs> package! Look what's in there. Is a dog sniffing your package? Hey, package? I have packages for you. Oh. Hey. Oh. So look what we've got. That's for David? Yeah, this is for David. I think he's gonna, I don't know what he's gonna do with that. That's for me. 
96% off or something like that, right? Something like that. <laughs> That's also for David. Mm -hmm. Is that got Norman Reedus' head in there? Yeah, it does. Ooh, are you warm? That's a surprise. There's pajama bottoms here. And if you saw last video, or maybe the video before, he got me for Christmas, Mr. Star Wars Arcade. Yeah, and Merry Christmas. Woo! Did you pay $499 for it? Uh, you will never know. Is it Less dollars than that? Maybe. Look at all the Amiibo! Oh my, I have more. You know what's crazy about that, though? They're still in the box? They're in the box, but also, there's no, like, Luigi or reg like you never got a luigi well just like weird ones like i don't like i have like a dr mario i don't have like the original mario turn on that lightsaber and touch it it's star wars day after all is that ma mace yeah this is maces are you sad uh, that you're not at star wars tonight no i'm okay no rush i'm, I'm gonna see it monday night so you have no luigi what other ones do you not have look at the pokemon puzzle um i don't know just like random ones i don't care about like, I don't think I ever got, like, a Donkey Yeah, we Kong. fit trainer. I don't have her, but I have a villager. Let's, I like a let's look closer. You have Poochie? I do have Poochie. You don't have the big yarn, Yoshi. Oh, do I not? Well, let me have this link. I don't have that link. Right here, right here. Oh, you do have the big Poochie? Well, I do, too. And Detective Pikachu. I got my, um... Some Black Series? Yep. Yeah, I've had friends. this for a long time. I got the murder droids. Those are all your peeps. Those are some of my favorites. You have uh, Daft the, Punk SH Figure Arts. Yeah, Boba. Boba. Don't you have Daft Punk SH Figure Arts somewhere? Oh yeah, down there. Those are uh, those are hard to come by, and you have you've had them for a long time. Uh, twenty. 14, 15. Look at Android over there, just tilting it up. Yeah, she's on point. Woo! What are we playing here? Is that the World of Warcraft? No, we're playing. Oh, safety. Oh, I'm about to play here. Oh! Bummer. All right, let me finish looking at the amiibo. Uh, I wonder if you have any. Yeah, you do. You have that link that I don't have that I somehow missed. And that wasn't Ken in that assortment? Yeah. And there's one other. Yeah, it was uh, the Isabel. That's like impossible to find. Oh, great. What great news. I don't have those three. Poopy. Almost every Amiibo I have, I would have bought from James over the years. Yeah. And probably those nearly every one except for the, yeah, and the Jap Japanese ones. <laughs> Ooh! What? What you want? James is twitching it right now. I'm so twitchy. Streaming wow. What's this thing do? So this is cool. Um, so let's say I want to, like, uh... Touch you in your no-no square. Oh, yeah. But I don't want everybody to see. I have this set up to... Um, it mutes me, and it gives me a viewer of Askery. And uh, it basically just flips between... So it's like hotkeys that can control hardware, too. Correct. Kind of. You can also set this for to do a ton of different stuff. You can set it to, like, change Spotify stuff. You uh, could, I can, like, just mute myself. So this is what people are doing to quickly... Yes. You or can, can actually, you like dump up like you your send, uh, support the channel yes. here and like all that kind of stuff? Tweets. Oh, like uh, promote Ham hey, Live now. Yes. How much is a stream deck? Uh, so I got it for like twenty dollars. They retail for like a hundred. Huh? Does it? Ha I'm sure it has software with it too. Wait, hey, use Maze Key. Use Maze Key. Yeah, use Maze Key. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah Maze that. Adult Video. That key. The key to get inside. No. Is this where the uh, Leroy Jenkins part happens? Uh, yes. Let me fix my gear real quick. I can barely hear you, bro. Well, diarrhea. You know, nobody opposes diarrhea. That's not a thing to say. No. James, what's your Twitch handle so the people watching Dub Life can come find you? Uh, Sir Mini Donut. Is there any numbers? Uh, nope. Sir, S-I-R. Yeah, S-I-R. Mini, M-I-N-I, Donut, D-O-N-U-T. Yeah, type it up there. I'll show them or pull up your profile. Where's your profile? It's right here. I don't know. That's a If you want to watch James on Twitch, Sir Many Donut. He's on quite a bit, fairly frequently. A lot of the World of Warcraft. It's, uh, yeah, pretty sensitive yeah. World of Warcraft, and his team is uh, pretty top, well top, top 500 US. Top 500 in the US. So if you want to watch that, Sir Many Donut. 
And I think on Instagram it's similar, right? But you have yeah. numbers on Instagram. No, I don't think so. Just serve many donut. I think so. You know, is that a donut like you know the donut that comes out of the hoo ha when you do ta? I'm not sure what that means, but I like you. James gave me a cookie. Mm hmm. He asked for a cookie. I gotta go do a bunch of stuff. Thank I'll see you, you tomorrow. Coming. We're gonna take James to lunch for his birthday tomorrow. Mm hmm. Can't okay. wait. Hands on your bottom. Woo! Back home. Like I said, I gotta edit three videos tonight, so I got a lot to do. Got to see James for a little while. Picked up Star Wars Arcades in the garage. It'll be another video before we have a chance to put that together and get it over there by those two. And now we have all of the original released arcades. Exciting. None, none of the like exclusive um, multi cab or any of those, but all the regular release ones. Happy about it. Uh, so this was a bonus day. I wasn't going to start today, but I started today. But for now, we'll talk to you in the morning. Good morning, day two. Hope you enjoyed the bonus day. I don't know if it's really a bonus. I just started earlier and I plan to. Uh, video will probably go the same. I don't know. T and the B. I got all that stuff. Well, not the fryer and elephant. Those are mine. But everything else, it's Christmas gifts that I got to pack up. Uh, we're going to go see James here in about an hour uh, for his birthday. Take him to lunch. Give him his birthday present he also has a christmas present wrapped separately in there which he may or may not open while we're in front i don't know touch it uh so i gotta get the car packed up it's gonna be hard it's a lot of stuff it's a lot uh but first because it's the 20th i need to do today's advent calendar and since i won't be here for the 21st 22nd 23rd 24th i have to film opening those i know it's cheating it's what you have to do because I can't carry all that around with me, or I'm not going to. Uh, so let me do my Advent stuff for the gram real quick. Film the other ones I need for the future days. And I'm going to show you the full array that came in the Marvel Funko Advent Calendar. Let me share with you the results of the Advent Calendar. These are in day order, so starting with December 1st. Gold Iron Man, Captain America, Red Hulk. I know that there's a regular Iron Man and a Green Hulk in a different box. Mine's a GameStop box. I do not know what else has been different. Thor, Black Suit Spidey, Loki, Venom, Daredevil, Black Widow, Miles, Spider-Man, Doctor Strange, Black Panther, Thanos, Spider-Gwen, Captain Marvel, Punisher, Vision, Rocket Raccoon, Groot, Star-Lord, Ultron, Iron Fist, Gamora, and She-Hulk. show you this box, too, because it's cool. It's got good box art, as you can see. I wonder if in another box, some of these characters, like Ant-Man, Hawkeye, that weren't in this are in a different one, or did they just use the art? I thought this was fun. It was a good value. I don't know, 30 bucks, something like that. I got it from GameStop and it was fun to open every day. Um, I think that these are pint sized heroes, I think. They're not bobbleheads, which is different from Marvel Stars. So they must be small enough to not be considered figures. I think they make a container that I can put these in and hang on the wall. If so, I might get that because they're kind of cool. Um, I thought it's interesting. Everything is in either a Marvel produced, like Disney Marvel, or Sony produced product, except for She-Hulk. She-Hulk has not been live action or like an animated on the big screen movie yet. And that was the final one. And I know that they're uh, coming out with She-Hulk later. So maybe that's intentional. Obviously all comic styling, uh, not MCU style. So uh, I really liked them. I think they look good. All right, let's get the the truck, but van, v let's get packed. Not too bad. I gotta leave that empty space there. For my suitcase because i still gotta pack myself finish laundry but that's not too bad still got some hints of blue on the driveway questionable see i got the star wars there the cocktail for david to pick up those will be here for a while i think david's actually going to come pick this up as a christmas present but uh all right i will talk to you when i go get james ah. oh the birthday boy Hello. That's a birthday thigh touch. How Happy birthday. I'm good. Do you come here often? Uh, yeah. As a matter of fact, 
You have a prize. Oh, that's exciting. You have a prize too. It's my deposit that's going to the bank across the street. Oh, rob it. Hey, we're going to the mall. Okay. Is that exciting for you? Uh, if it's what you want. It's what I want. I gotta pick up a figure for David. Stick it in the ear. What, spe what specifically in the ear? Goose. Nope, don't have a goose on me. So in the red is your birthday present, and then there's a gray present inside that's your Christmas present. Am I allowed to open it now? Yeah, open it, whatever you want to do. Oh, it's Midoriya. Should I? Do you think he would match well with my Daft Punk figmas? Yeah, uh, I think he'll uh, look you have good. Art stuff. I like, I like him. He's really cool. Have you watched more of this? No. The newest season is really good. You need to get on it. That's dog on a it. Date night with us when we watch it. I we should. We, we should have a date night. Right from back. Japan. Does that make you happy? That's pretty freaking cool. I'm gonna show off this to Eugene. He'll be very jelly. Are you gonna like ride it like a pony? I don't think that would be good for the packaging. Ooh, package. <laughs> Are you going to look at your Christmas present too? Yeah, I am. See, it is actually separately wrapped in case you want to put it under the tree. That looks really nice. Yeah, I you're, did a good job. You're a sweet boy. Amazon did a good job. I am, oh. It's not as exciting. Well, it's exciting. Oh, this is for another double data bus. Yay. And with this, I will get something off Amazon. And then we will, we will get the box in. I will bring it to your house and we'll unbox it. So it's like you get another piece of content for my birthday those are yes those are less sexy presents so they're good that one i had to pre-order like four months ago from japan when That's they crazy. announced the re-release so you could have it you're sweet i appreciate it yay <laughs> belly rub it rub it huh? rub it rub it harder pony let's do it ride it my pony baby give us a little shake now a little shake. Oh, that was like a poot. Uh, so somehow for James's birthday on his like limited lunch break, we're getting a figure for David from the mall. David! David's got me right What? He I figured that I know for a fact you have. So yeah, what but, is this? So here's the thing though, is David it's not a sale. Know. Are they on clearance or something? David doesn't know that I'm doing this. He's like, just get me a set. And then this is me being the. But they're barrier. just regular price, no bag or they're anything. 25% off. Oh, it's the bag sale? Yeah. Well, no, there's just 25% off figures right now. But I'm just being a barrier to entry for David or whatever. David, right? this is what we're doing for James' birthday. I think you owe him nudes. Uh, okay. We could get Cinnabon for lunch for your birthday. Just like all of those. You wanna get all of those for your birthday and just eat them all? No, I don't need that. Like how much for the the whole lot? Uh, and I were at the mall game stop that James used to run like 400 years ago. You can get a shock trooper helmet. An Ant-Man helmet. Oh, there's a lot of helmets. A Mega Man X Buster. And... Oh, that's Lucifer. We have a box lunch. Take a lap through the box lunch. Yeah. Hot Topic owns box lunch. You know, they also own Torrid. Uh, I think they, I think the, the holding company does, but they spun tore it off. Well, right now, when Torrid gets shipped in, the boxes say, if found jacked up, ship back, back to Hot Topic. Yeah. I think the holding company is the same. They used to be, like, the rewards program was the same. But they're not anymore. Topic? Yeah, Hot Cash and Hot Cash, H-A-U-T-E. And you could be interchangeable, but they've separated that at least. Touch yourself now, hey. So box lunch, there's one in Kennesaw, but this is the first time that we've had one in the Mall of Georgia. So that's good. I don't know why we're doing, you want that upside down screen thing sweater? That's kind of cool. There's a friend's shirt. Everybody wants that. Do you hear the dash point? I do. I like the avatar. One more time. Check out the avatar up there. Oh. Do you want this Goku and Vegeta baseball box launch exclusives? Uh, Taylor might want that. You're, you were wanting to say no, and then you're like, oh, possibly. What about that Kaioken Goku up there? No? Kaioken. I think I had that in my store. <laughs> oh, what are we gonna eat? I don't know. What about this, uh, do you like this S4 Goku? Is that from, uh... I don't like GT stuff. I don't like GT. Poor GT. It just says ball. I do like design a lot. Do you want to, like, sit on its head? Nope. It's Maleficent as the dragon. 
It actually says as the dragon. Oppa? I got it. Hmm. Well. Yeah. It's nice and new in here. There's Mr. J. Oh. So even though it's James' birthday, and then David sent us to the store, we found Eli, a friend. Eli is, uh, do you work at the box lunch yeah. now? Just opened up, tell us about it. I uh, opened up after, I think, a day before Thanksgiving, and I got, it's probably my fifth or sixth day here. And you gave me the tip to go to Wizards in yeah, Gainesville. Wizards in Gainesville, shout out to them. So, uh, Eli underscore McClure underscore, underscore the number one. Um, and if you fo uh, follow me on Instagram, you can find it on here. Check Eli out, give, right, give him a, a shout out. He's hollering at you, Mr. Pence, as well. Josh will be down here actually in a couple, uh, like February, really? beginning of February. So uh, uh, we're just gonna hang out, but we can try to stop by and say hello. Oh, dude, that'd, yeah. be, that'd be awesome. Yeah, yeah, yeah for sure. Time. All right, tell cool, Josh, man. Tell Josh to pull up. Pull up, hey, T and the B. Well, now we're here for checkers. Checkers is the birthday uh, selection. Small as mine. There's cheesesteaks. There's you can have gyro there. Cheesesteaks. You don't want uh, this farmer's basket? You're gonna get farmer's basket at least you somewhere. No, I'll get checkers with you. It's your birthday. You gonna get the bacon zilla? Yeah, get the bacon zilla. Yeah. Oh. identical twinsies. What's this thing called? Baconator? Baconzilla. I think you just asked if it was a... It is a Baconator, thing. yeah. It is, very much so. Um, Baconzilla, no cheese sauce, appetizer chicken bites that James just dumped all the fries in, and Mr. Pip. Twinsies for the birthday, <laughs> yes. Take a big juicy bite of chicken bite. <laughs> no? Well, we got to tell James goodbye. He's got to go back to work. Did you have a good birthday lunch? I did. <laughs> Fingering it. Um, well, have a happy birthday. Thank Here you. Here comes uh, some lamb gyros. Yes. Touch it now. Boop. Ooh, I'm off to the parents' house. Ooh, look at that butt. Mmm, yeah. Well, I'm not with James anymore. Now I'm with these people that aren't interested in my camera because they want Mexican food. Last time they saw us, I was taking James to birthday lunch. Oh, fun times. It's James's birthday today. Uh, so we're going to Vallarta. Yes. I'm having maybe fajitas. Joe's special. <laughs> do, do that again? Joe's special. What, what's the karate chops for? Uh, uh, chopping up that chicken. Oh. What? Just what a big tease. I've got a taco Tuesday menu and it's not Tuesday. It's Friday. <laughs> One, two, Friday. Pollo con crema is the special. Don't you like that too? Or that doesn't chop, chop, chop? I'm going to have to peruse the specials. La Preferida. Well, that actually sounds kind of good. Mom, are you going to get fajitas? I don't know. I don't think you so. want to get fajitas with me? If you'll share them with me. I will. Katie There's probably fajitas okay. we can get. Yes, delicious. Sizzling fajitas. That's the thing that makes you do the cha-cha slide in the parking lot, what is it? Joe's special, it's rice, chicken, and cheese dip. It's all that like green stuff, peas. No, well that's, no, that's green carrots. peppers. That makes you sad. I could do without that. We got fajitas. A hippopotamus for Christmas. Christmas time. Ooh. It should be a quiet evening. Uh, Mom and Dad just went to get Granddad, pick him up as he's coming to visit. Kim and Michael being late tonight, so I'm going to show you a little bit of Mom's Christmas setup, and we'll let her talk more about that later in the video, and then we'll uh, call it a night. Let's look at some trees. This is in the, the main place where we open presents. 
where you can see a bunch of presents here piled up. Uh, and this is like an upstairs living room. Uh, kind of a, I don't know, where mom plays the piano. It's uh, used to be the dining room and part of the kitchen, but they expanded the house out that way. So you see, you got the table set up for Christmas dinner. Very nice, and another tree there. And then let's go downstairs. And down here in the den, got another tree there. And she probably has a tree in her room. I, I, she usually has like four or five trees. And then she's got her kind of her Christmas village set up. What are these penguins? Victoria's a big penguins fan, as I think you all know now. And there's more Christmas village here. Some of the light up ones including the Fox Theater that you see us go to. Very cool. If you're watching, I'm in Myrtle Beach. I'm always tempted to get Christmas villages and set them up. But Mom, I'm sure, has more than this. There might be some upstairs that I missed. Um, I like them. I'm always tempted to get a bunch of them. Anyway, we're going to wait for everybody to arrive and greet and it'll be some relaxing time. So... We will check in with you tomorrow. Tomorrow is when we will actually open our presents, do our Christmas on uh, whatever tomorrow is, the 20, uh, 25, 24, 23, the 21st, because most of us have to work on the 23rd. So people come in this weekend and leave. So we'll open presents tomorrow. We're going to go to Sheely's <laughs> tomorrow for some barbecue. And uh, then we'll have formal Christmas there on the 22nd after church. So that's what you have to look forward to. Talk to you in a bit. Or tomorrow or in a bit uh, safety good morning mom's upstairs playing the piano for everybody as we get ready uh kim and mike arrived late last night actually we were all asleep granddad's arrived from his flight and uh here in a little while we're all gonna head to lunch we're gonna drive out sheely's hour-ish away from where we are and have barbecue at a place we all grew up at and granddad likes to visit when he's here. Uh, like I told you, and this is our Christmas day. So uh, as you're watching this, it's a couple weeks after Christmas, but I hope you had a good Christmas and New Year and all that stuff. And I hope you've been enjoying the content that we've been putting out. Put a lot of content out in the month of December for December, And I don't know how much of that I'm still putting out as we're into January, but I wanted to give you a bunch in December for Christmas. So let's get the day going let me show you a thing that i just saw pop up in facebook actually a place i'm not normally going to click things and order things but i had to let me show you look at that i mean you know i'm getting that right the baby yoda ravens hoodie i gotta get that i'm not familiar with t-hag at all but it's got a secure authentication website so i'm imagining it's just like teespring and all the other things like that uh it's a campaign so i have no idea when they get made but i ordered for the express shipping and i got one for me and one for victoria she doesn't know that hopefully by the time you're watching the video we have it i hope we have them before we go to baltimore which is uh eight days away so i don't know if that'll happen but i tried if not, maybe we'll have them for New Year's or something. Playoffs. I don't know. <laughs> I couldn't resist. I had that. Oh, 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 baby Yoda. Victoria. Yeah. Do you know I was sitting here and I was on Facebook and a Facebook ad popped up. And I was like, huh, I wonder, should I get this right okay. away for a trip next week to Baltimore? Okay. And so I just decided to buy it and pay for express shipping from some site I've never heard of ever, like mom does. Okay. Do you think it's a good thing or a bad thing? <laughs> I don't know. What do you think it is that I bought each of us one of? Each of us? That I have no clue. It may not be here for six months. <laughs> and I paid $37 for express shipping. What did you buy? What do you think it is? I have no idea. All right, I'm going to send you a picture. Get your phone. Okay. And you tell me if I made the correct choice. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> you 
Your thoughts? <laughs> um, I think... <laughs> wow, I believe um, that was the right choice. <laughs> <laughs> you agree with the choice? Yes. Do you hope that it comes in before we go to Baltimore? Yes. <laughs> Is that the Baby Yoda design you're looking for? <laughs> Pretty much. I, I, think, I think the answer is yes to all Baby Yoda design, but yes. That doesn't look like the one off Etsy? You know, like the one that's like, uh, looks like the... the oh, one. no, no, that's a good one. Yeah, yeah, no, no, he looks adorable. And then I realized it said campaign. I'm like, oh, I just, I'm going to get it in one day in the middle of April. Yeah. Or something yeah. like that. Yeah. I have no idea. I don't know what tea hag is. It kind of sounds like tea bag. Oh, no. We're in the car on the way to Sheely's Barbecue. Victoria, this is the one year anniversary of when you ate an entire plate of rice and gravy and chicken before we even sat down from the buffet and went back for a second. I'm not doing that this year. Is that because within 37 seconds later you had a bathroom emergency? I felt horrible. I don't believe my stomach has ever felt that bad. That's the first time you've ever had the rice and gravy from Sheila. It was so good. So are you saying you're just going to have like kale and the broccoli salad today? I don't believe they serve kale. Um, but no. No rice and gravy? I'm having rice and gravy. I'm just not having more. Are you going to get a bowl? Yes. Okay. Moderate rice and gravy. Might you? Are you going to have a chicken? I'm going to have a chicken. Oh, a whole chow. Can you? Corn green beans? Are you hopeful for liver notes? I hope they have noodles. <laughs> Ooh, they're gonna have, yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, we've arrived. Sheely's Barbecue. Mom, are you excited for this? Yeah, I'm excited. Do you know I, that this I is- I didn't eat breakfast. Me I'm either. real excited. You know this is the one year anniversary where Victoria ate all of the food before y'all even got here and they got real sick and well, learned to like gravy and rice? Oh. Well, granddad's here as well. Are you excited for this? I'm excited. Come on, ride the buffet train and ride it. Oh, look, there's nobody here. I can walk right up and show you. Oh, sausage. Big piles of sausage. Oh. Ribs. Gravy. Oh, yeah. This is what you need in your life. A little bit of all of this. Chicken. Oh, yeah. Victoria, you cannot wait for sausage, right? What? No, there's sausage. Mm. Bacon. No chicken? Not yet. Not yet. On the way. Mm. Mac and cheese, beans. Mm. Three types of barbecue. I cleared off my meats and put them in my belly so that I could have one of these chickens. Holy bone. Tiny little wishbone and all the rest chicken. There you can see the bone like down in there. All the rest chicken. Mm -hmm. See, I know you hate look it when they move. Look at that. Hey, Dad. I noticed when we we're driving over. Mom, did you hear this? What? When we we're driving over, the interstate exit said all wide loads must exit here. And so I got off. Yeah. That's right. <laughs> it knows because this is where the buffet is. I agree. <laughs> Mom, do you feel like you had a great victory of eating? I wish I could have eaten more. Oh, coupons. That's for you and Granddad. Sparkly eyes. Do you feel like you had a great victory of eating? Yeah. You want to go dunk your head in the gravy, no, Bob, for sausage? Oh. Oh, Barry. We just took a picture with a sign, and I was going to put it, frame it using the windshield wipers of the minivan as my tripod. I actually have a tripod in the van. Mom made someone else take it for us. You didn't like the windshield wipers technique? It didn't look like it was working, babe. Oh, I could have figured it out. Mm -hmm. I, I gotta get the shot. What what would have happened? Get the shot, that's the main thing. What I'm afraid would have happened, the shot, of I'll, I'll, sh I'll put it right here. What I'm afraid <laughs> would have happened is the person in the van would have showed up and left while we were With trying to, phone? and the phone would have just driven away. That would have been a bad day. All right, it's time for Santa Claus, right? Oh. You say so, y'all were always Get your oh, safety. Early. Oh, I passed gas. Oh, get away. We are back home. Uh, you can sit here. And I'm going to try to set up a little time lapse for us opening the presents. So hopefully it works. Mommy, you excited for presents? Kim and Mike are just in the seat ready. Bring on the presents. This is my pile of presents. Mom's got the big pile. Big pile. Time lapse. Okay. 
<laughs> That's wonderful. <laughs> I want a hippopotamus for Christmas. Did everybody have a good Christmas? Yes. Yes. Everybody, hooray! Mom, you got a lot of shoelaces. I got a lot of shoelaces and hymn books. Are you going to piano get more books? Shoes? Yeah, books. <laughs> That's right. She, she got. She gets more shoelaces than shoes. she has shoes. Like, yeah. I got shoes and a lot. We had a good Christmas. I'll yeah. show you my presents yeah. in a little bit. Things for my feet to stand on. And Things for the feet. Let me show you the gifts I got. I got uh, Ken Amiibo and Link Amiibo. Two of those three I'm missing. Uh, there's one other from that wave I need to get. Game Boy coffee mug that when you put coffee in it, you get the victory screen. Um, from Mom and Dad and Kim, Victoria got me this tripod mount for my Osmo. A Thor trade. New York City Lego. Well, that'll be the first Lego I've put together in 30 years, probably. Two Echo Wall Clocks. The whole four Batman in 4K, which I'm excited for. And then Kim made me matching pillows. Ooh, shaking now. To go with the quilt she made me last year. These are couch pillows that she handmade. All the turtles, attention to detail, and I love them. And Mom got me a hippopotamus for Christmas. How wonderful. I'm very grateful to everybody. I love it. Sugar no more presents. Now it's pizzas. Pizzas is a present. Pizza present? It's a present for your time. Is that a salad with ham? Yes. And cheese and Pepperonis. And pineapples. Ooh, who's a pineapple person? Granddad, by request, pineapples. I am also a pineapple person. Oh, good. We can help him eat it. Pineapple. I will have a piece of this. Ooh, burger. Mike said he's going in for pineapple. No. Mike's having I'm salad. Have, oh, you know, it's so smart. Mm -hmm. you this way so you mm -hmm. have some. So many corners, which are the Granddad's confused. Are you enjoying your pizza? Yes, I am. I like this guy kind of pizza. Mom's playing Imperial March from oh, Star on. Wars weekend. Is that in the new book? One of them. 
You got a lot of piano books. A whole lot. Let's go see what's happening in here. Victoria, what you doing? I'm taking a picture of pie. Taking a picture of pie? Yeah. So it's pie time. It's pie time. Oh. It's pie time. Can we have pie and cookies and milk and make a milk and pie and cookies scenario? Can we? Yes. Should we? Yes. Broadway debut. Do I sing first? Yes. Yes. You're wrong. Yeah, you're I'm singing? ready. I'm ready. Okay, ready? Yep. No more talk of darkness. My words will warm and calm you. This is going on Facebook. <laughs> no. Oh, yes. Let daylight dry. We sang songs at the piano, watched football for a while with dad and granddad, and I took a nap in the recliner, and now it's uh, 11.24. I need to go to sleep. So, whoops. Talk to you in the morning. Good Sunday morning, and welcome to day three, four, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, four. Day four, because we started a day early. And uh, I was getting ready to go pick up Granddad and head to church. And uh, I got stopped in my tracks by a prize and a package. Do you want to see them? <laughs> package and donuts. Package and raspberry donut. We took one of those. Now let's see what's in the package. Package that came to me here. <laughs> I know what it is. Yes. Marineside Collectibles sale. They had a Stitch Figure Art Stone Cold for seven dollars. SH Figure Arts Rock for eight dollars. 
this age figure arts triple h for four dollars limit five so i bought five um i have all these those three are going to go to andrew as part of his christmas he'll get those three i'm going to give one to steve as part of his christmas and the other three i don't know what i'm gonna do with and then finally they had these for eleven dollars instead of thirty and the Rousey Ultimate Edition and the Nakamura Ultimate Edition. And I think I'm going to collect the Ultimate Editions, just the Ultimates. I need to get the Bret Hart, Finn Balor, Triple H, and Ultimate Warrior. That's what's in the package. Okay, time for church. Honestly, not sure where we're at on this video. I'm headed to pick up Granddad, take him to church, and then meet everybody there. Um... Things are pretty scattered, as you can see. Normally, I try to keep a fairly consistent flow of storytelling. Uh, but this weekend is about spending time with my family, not making a, a video. And the video is just kind of on the side. And uh, we did want to share part of our Christmas with you, so we did. Um, even though it's only the 22nd, right? Yeah. 22nd. Raven's play today. But, so I don't know. I uh, hope you're enjoying it. I'll probably end the video either today or definitely tomorrow. Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. I will uh, stay with the family and we'll pick up when Victoria and I are going to Baltimore. So I hope you're enjoying it. I hope it's long enough. Uh, we have Christmas dinner today. The mom's cooking, which uh, for us is always very similar to Thanksgiving dinner because that's a lot of our favorite meal that she cooks. So we're excited for that. Turkey and such. There'll be probably some small changes. Uh, and also granddad hasn't had that mom's cooking since last Christmas. And the Ravens play the Browns today. If the Ravens win, they're the number one overall seed in the playoffs. So that would be exciting. And I don't know what else. I think uh, we may have a visitor tonight. So, all right. I'm going to have Granddad go to church and speak with you when we get back home from church. Unless, uh, maybe we'll take a family picture. And I'll show you the, the family church picture. You know, hey, fancy. We're home from church and it's supper cooking time. Lunch cooking time. Rolls and taters. What is this over here? Pineapple casserole? No, it's broccoli. Broccoli casserole? What's going in that cast iron skillet? Nothing. No. Moving it out of the way. Is there a turkey in the oven? Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> Mom, don't I look handsome in my vest, sweater vest? You, you do. Yes. Yeah. And we took a picture. Okay. Did you see okay. it? Well, yeah, I need a. Ooh, ah, ooh. <laughs> Victoria. Yeah. This is the last time, hopefully, that I wear this jersey. You can wear it next week. And then the next time I would wear it, hopefully, is if they're in the Super Bowl. Oh, my goodness. Because this is what I wear when they're not at home. And hopefully, today they secure home field advantage all the way into the Super Bowl. Which means. If I wear it again yeah. after today, they're in the yeah, Super Bowl. Yeah, yeah. How long do you think that would be on me? What? That jersey. At the game? Yeah. Like, how long do you think it will be on me? Will it be to my knees? Oh, how long? Not amount length. of time. No, length. no, no, no. Yeah, probably to the <laughs> knees. I was like, you ain't taking it off. It's going to be cold no, in Baltimore. That's not what in I meant. In December. <laughs> You're not going to be in the nude in the stadium. <laughs> Not it's against the NFL policy. <laughs> and Tracy Wilson, the Ravens today out to lock up the number one seed. In oh, the yeah. They would get it Go, the Ravens. Ball number ball one seed time. Victoria, what does that music mean? Football? It means the Ravens are about to play on CBS. Okay. With Jim Nance and Tony Romo on the call, the A team. Oh, okay. Oh, shake it. Yeah, Hi. give us a little. Oh. Are you excited to be watching in person next week? Uh -huh. Yes. Do you hope that big raven is available? Yes. Yes. The rooting interests today are an exercise in long-term vision and not short-term. Okay. Long-term vision. Okay. Because it is in our selfish best interest for Baltimore to lose today so that next week they're playing the Steelers for number one in the playoffs. Okay. And have everything in the world to play for when we're there. Yeah, yeah. That's in our best interest. Yeah. But it is in the team's best interest to win today 
rest Lamar Jackson next week and Mark Ingram and Earl Thomas and Marshall Yonda and some of the older starters. And we get to see uh, the, the, the backups play mm-hmm. so that they can be rested to try to win the Super Bowl. Yes. So we're cheering for the long-term vision yes. with the victory yes. today, which is kind of counterintuitive, but that's what we want. Yes. And we will watch Trace McSorley hopefully play. Yeah, I would love yeah that. me too. Touch it. Victoria has seen Trace McSorley play in person and won. Trace McSorley is 1-0 and when Victoria and I watch him play in person. <laughs> and it was for the Big Ten Championship, yeah, so it was a good game. game. Yeah, yeah, T and the B, boop. Oh. But this is a defense. Victoria, what do you think is going to happen on this play? It's um, second and six. They're going to run the ball? Who's going to run it? I don't know who's in the game. Lamar Jackson? Lamar Jackson, yeah, yeah. Let's see. Yeah, 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 come on. No, he's, oh. Oh, he's throwing it. Oh, the Gus, the Gus, the bus, the Gus bus. Okay. Yes. We've departed the Ravens game. Mom's done something with Saran wrap, apparently. But Christmas supper's ready. Yay. I have a full plate, Mom. I even have some of that dressing with the peppers and the onions. This has got green onions. Oh, the Ravens are not playing well. They're losing 6 nothing halfway through the second quarter, and they're turned it over, penalties, poopy. But dinner was delicious. I may take a nap, you know, a nap. Victoria came in to take a nap, and the Ravens scored to tie the game. So what does that mean, Victoria? I have to stay here. Yeah, and you weren't asleep, so you're not allowed to go to sleep either. You just have to kick it. Victoria, can you tell the camera what happened since the last time we checked in and the Ravens scored a touchdown with you there? Uh, the Ravens scored another touchdown. Yeah. So two touchdowns in like a minute and ten seconds with you. So, Victoria, so. you're going to be there Yeah. the rest of playing time. Apparently the only so. time you can lose is when there's a timeout. Yeah. No, you just gotta ride with it. Yeah. I'll get your bedpan if needed. Yeah. <laughs> You'll bring me pie. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> pie and bedpan, that's an interesting dichotomy. <laughs> it's 24 to 9, but Victoria left the sofa, so I'm a little worried. Need to wrap this one up. Hooray! The couch worked. Someone's at the door. 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 Oh! Steve's at the door. He was just listening to you play the piano standing there. It's wonderful, isn't it? It is. It is. It really is. It's not a. I don't recognize. What is it? Mom believes she should be she should be Bach at this yeah, stage. No, Why? but I will play you something you recognize. Ooh, by, by all means. Are you okay. hopeful it's the thong song? No, no. it's sweet. There's sweet Christmas songs. Oh. Oh, well, Steve, do you know what happened today? What happened? The Baltimore Ravens are the number one seed in the AFC playoffs, and now they can rest for two weeks. Which means we might get to see Trace McSorley play quarterback next week because Lamar will almost surely rest. Yeah, right. So he should be active. Right. It's a red velvet cake again. <laughs> so it's so disappointing to have it a second time. You want a prize? Here, this is your only Christmas present. My only one? Yeah. Okay. Open it now. Open. Go, 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 go. It is certainly, yes. it is not your only Christmas present. But you got a $5 Triple H. Can right. you believe they had those for $4.99? I know, that's crazy. I bought five of them. Yeah, they're, I mean, they're good. Yeah, they're good. it's a good figure. All right, here's your real Christmas okay. present. My real one? Ordered like nine months ago, pre-order. It's not, I mean, it's just regular. It's, you, you, I don't think you have it. I hope you don't have it. Oh. Does that please you? Oh, yes. Gonna, are you gonna make good. those two figures fight each other? I, I just might. Oh my gosh! Yes, this is fantastic. Right from Japan. How does it make yeah, you feel in the loins? <laughs> yeah. Ooh. <laughs> that is fantastic. Like right at stairs. Meanwhile, Victoria's just eating an entire piece of cake. Victoria. My Victoria. So, I'll do it too. Victoria said we should go get a um. It's really good. A blizzard. <laughs> While eating the cake. Yeah. <laughs> Your mom makes such control. Steve, what? I don't. 
pull it out. No, I, mean, I don't know what's happening here. <laughs> you know what this means. I, uh... I do. You, get, I mean, you know what you like to say, right? Take a look at that sausage. Mom, what do you think that this if present's I gonna be? Video, be more a big time lapse of it? What do you think that Steve got me? I don't know. It looks like it's from Amazon. It is not from Amazon. Oh, it's a trick. Well, although, well, I'm depancing it. Oh, it's kind of heavy. Maybe it's Woolworths items. Ooh. Your present? Oh. Yes. Oh, this is my, yeah, yeah, this is Ooh, it's wrapped in tissues. Is it Victoria's tissues that she tissue likes paper. to get? Actually, I wish I had some tissues. Victoria, do you have extras? Quite girthy. Oh, boy. Ooh, bookies. Hooray. Oh. Game of Thrones graphic novels. Ooh. Thank you. Yes. Oh, oh, oh. Ooh. Oh, look, Victoria. Do you want to look at one? Yeah. Here, let's show the people over your shoulder. Now open one up. Uh, oh, Bustier style, you know. What? Huh? What? What? Made in there. Ooh. The battlegrounds. Oh, nice. Oh, cool. Ooh. Go show us some pictures. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Uh, read us a story. Read. Oh. That was because Victoria doesn't know how to read that. It's not true. <laughs> Here, have some of that. Just put them in the mouth. Oh my just put some in the mouth. What is this? I don't know. Just put. I don't know. You don't know. You like just put it in the mouth. Yeah, you mouth. don't know what it is. But you I'll go with mouth. you. One, two, three, go. Yeah, 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 yeah. One, two, three, go. One, two, three, go. Hmm. Oh. Yep. Go. Hello. Right in the mouth. Hmm. Okay. So you gotta, you got the head's gonna be under the action, oh. and you gotta, you got a double oh. underhook, Steve. You gotta, that, that's oh. like that, <laughs> like that. That's how you, that's how you, that's how you get Optimus Prime in did the you, pedigree. I don't know what this is a picture of. Did you, did you like that video? I hope you did. Oh, Mom, do you think you can help Steve put in the wrestler move? You want to show Steve how to do the wrestling move like Steve and I just did? No, no, no. no that's, that's no. Under no circumstances? No, absolutely not. I, I respect your mom too much for that. Oh. <laughs> Unless you need down the toilet or oh. something. Oh. Steve, what are you doing? What is what is this pose here? He's getting ready to stand on his head. Oh. What do you think is happening there, Mom? He's riding a horsey, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Why is there a stick right there in his bum? <laughs> what do you think? Why? Spanking? Y'all be nice. What? Be nice to toys. <laughs> <laughs> like be are nice you, to are, 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 we <laughs> are you mad at us because we're making fun of Optimus Prime? I don't know who that is. Oh. Steve, did you like that <laughs> Instagram filter? <laughs> What was that called? <laughs> Describe it for the good people of Double Life. They didn't get to see it. Oh, all right. So let me uh, just show them. Oh. oh I got to go back to it because it went all the way back to the beginning. Uh, really concerning. Describe all right. it. All right. So my face was on some kind of creature, and it looked like some kind of. I'm not hidden in the bushes. Okay, hold on. We, we got to go back. <laughs> oh, what's that? My crotch. <laughs> Um, all right, so this, this animal looks like a hybrid of pig and chihuahua and, with a litter of And pups. you, your face. And my face is in this creature. You know that Dreamcast game? Uh, oh, yeah. What, you know what, yes. I'm what is that game called? Dad, the man. weird one with the doll, or the, the weird one. Yeah, like this is what this reminds me yeah. of, that weird game on Dreamcast. So... My face is actually perfect for this, <laughs> and I am oh. just looking down. And then all of a sudden, 
I am now in the bushes. <laughs> maybe I'm a you. maybe I'm a hunter. I no, am you're in, a baby that doesn't. I am in oh. suit and tie. I'm snatching one of the babies. I'm they both have my face, same exact expression, and I'm dipping out. And I trip and fall with the other creature on all fours, like nothing happened. Walking back, and I look very confused. And I'm just going back and getting the milk. Steve, I'll give you $500 if you can convince everybody in this house to recreate that, including grandfather. Recreate that. That, like that, that yeah. Like, like, yeah. Do the, somebody's got to be I'll the... I'll let do it in real life. The, somebody's got to be the chihuahua. Somebody's got to be the hunter. No! Somebody's got to be the baby that no! gets stolen. Um, if it was your mom and dad... I'll give you I, 10 I bucks if you go I'd show try. granddad and explain to him <laughs> what, you need to, if you, <laughs> what you need to do and why you need to do it. Um, no. I'll give you ten dollars to not do that. <laughs> oh, see, come up. That's the come up. <laughs> I, I, I don't think I can do it. That's ten dollars. <laughs> Victoria, what did you just say? I, I said I'm just having a nice conversation with Granddad, and there's a dancing Thanos dancing to my Michael Bublé. Well, it's Christmas. <laughs> I took that picture. It's pretty. It's almost time for Mr. Robot. Um, Steve, do you think Victoria will weep during Mr. Robot's serious finale? You know nothing of Mr. Robot, yes? Yeah. Do you think there'll be weeping? I think so. I know she gets very Do emotional. you think there will be great exultation? Uh, sure. I think so. Do you think there will be anger? I think there's going to be a lot of emotions out of her. What out of me? You think I'm just going to be even keeled? No, because you're not like that. I mean, I, I think it'll be real emotional. No, I'm not even keeled. I know. Yeah. yeah. No, I am an emotional being. Yeah. There's very, very possibly going to be open weeping from both of us. Oh, I know there will be. <laughs> Got him. Steve, are you going to live blog on the Pence Pack channel? I'm now watching Brian and Victoria watch Mr. Robot. Someone just used the Instagram filter where they get put in the coffin and they get old. And I don't understand how that applies. <laughs> Is that what you're going to do? Uh, I, I don't know. Are you just going to sit up your hand in your pants? Mm. The Mr. Robot series finale is about to start. Victoria's got her Elliot look. Steve, yeah. are you going to watch or are you going to dip out and come back tomorrow? I think I'm going to dip out and come back tomorrow. Is that because you want to go do more uh, BDSM with Optimus Prime? Oh. Apparently so. Hope you didn't Sorry. actually. Victoria and I will check in if we're not weeping. This is my true Elliot look. Yeah. Well, hello, friend. I'm happy. Are you scared? I am. Mr. Robot's over. <laughs> Talk to you in the morning. <laughs>
all my other friends that are remote, I've sent them their gifts. Um, I hope to do Christmas with Andrew today. And uh, we might see Steve again. I think Steve and Victoria and I may go see Jumanji tonight. We haven't seen Star Wars yet, but we're not in a hurry to see that. But Jumanji, um, maybe we do want to see, even though we're a week late. So that may happen tonight. But uh, And then for Christmas Eve, Christmas Day, be off camera. I'll spend with my parents and Victoria. And I'll head back to Atlanta. So final day of the video. Hopefully you've enjoyed it. Lots of family time. Hopefully some laughs, some good stuff, touching it. You know, all that stuff. Let's see what today holds. Mm, they hold a safety. Hello again, it is much later. It's now 1.30 in the afternoon. I didn't film anything. We uh, we had breakfast with granddad and spent some time with him. And dad just dropped him off at the airport. So he's headed back to South Florida. So it's wonderful to get to see granddad. I know I didn't show him much on film as you can imagine. Um, but great to, uh, he just turned 87 I think. So I always enjoy spending time with him, learning from him, talking to him. Uh, so it's really great to have everybody around for Christmas time. I'm actually getting gas here. I'm about to go visit Andrew and see his family for Christmas. So let's do that. I just made weird choices. I just wanted a snack while I'm driving to Drew's. I got vanilla Pepsi. Never had that. Why I got Pepsi over Coke, I don't know. Don't know. And... Snickers trees, not the Reese's trees, the Snickers tree. What? I don't know. Weird choices. Come here, Gus. Gus, come talk to the good people here. Oh, no, Gus ran away. Knocks with it. Let me see. So I put this on and then I hit you with it, right? Oh, boom. Oh, no. Gus. Gus, you were all over my action before this was out. Look, there you go. Say hello. Mer? Yeah, I guess not. What are we playing? Fortnite. Fortnite. I have a uh, crotch full of uh, Game of Thrones books, thanks to the Jones family. Very I'm appreciating. You, is this, uh, they're seeing me in my natural habitat. They are. That's a rarity. They've only ever seen me. And he's just chilling, not interested. They, no. They, they've no. only ever seen me at uh, your house. That's true. So welcome to my house. Or at the Mall of Georgia. That's true. <laughs> in Lush. <laughs> yeah, our wrestling events. That's, that's true. Well, well, welcome to my house. I think. I, I don't want to, uh, I don't be too risque. I was told there's adult content. That's just a bald guy. It's rated uh, TVMA. Oh. <laughs> Here's Drew's Christmas tree. Drew, you built that above the mantle? I did, and I did the stonework on the fireplace. On the fireplace. There's Matosi and John Cena. You should open your present, your other present right there. That's right. your sack. Let's do it. It's a sack of, uh, well, you already have a sack of cameras. A uh, sack of cameras, which I will say, <laughs> I was afraid because there are cameras out there with pictures that uh, Wilson Of sack? And I, no, well, that Wilson and I, that uh, of a Bastista and stuff oh, like that. Oh, I, I would thought, love to I retrieve that. I thought you were that. bringing me like that, and I'm like, oh, God. Do you what? still have that phone? We need oh, to try I, to fix it. I don't know. I have fix to look that. and see. Oh my! What is this? Is quite the sack of extra goodies. Oh, whoa! What do you think, Gus? Yeah, a sack of goodies. Oh, you got a little Steve Austin. Oh, I don't have one of him. I've got. Oh, Ansley, do you smell what the Rock is cooking? That's a no. Only when he says safety. Oh, who's that? Triple H. Is he one of your favorites? He is. Oh, hooray. Gus, say hooray. You're Ooh. awesome, man. Thank you You're so much. You're welcome. I appreciate that. Oh, that's the package. Oh, where are the... I am wearing yes. these. Yes. Uh, to my first uh, work trip of the... I'm wearing these to Dallas. <laughs> when, I go, when I go to Dallas in a couple weeks. Show the people. The people. The good people. Woo! <laughs> Those are great. I did not know what they would look like. Oh, oh this is so good. Yeah, let's do it. It's like, oh, yeah, flare socks. Let's, let's have it. Let's do a little We're going to get them show. on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's fashion see. show. What do you think, Gus? Huh? Flare right socks? There. Right there. I guess that's just... An X? Yeah. Um, don't need to close that. Yeah, yeah, I don't know. That's probably because... Um, what? <laughs> Capri Sun? Look at that. Oh, that's wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> 
Oh yeah, you gotta wear those to to the workplace. Oh, I'm wearing them to work. Yes, I mean, that's, that's happening. <laughs> because somebody's gonna look and say, "Why do you have hands on your socks?" Oh, <laughs> no. would you like to know? <laughs> Woo! All right. Well, that was great. Got to see Andrew and the kids. Unfortunately, Melissa had to work, so I didn't get to see her, but spoke with her some. Uh, kids are having a good time. It's not quite Christmas, like I said earlier. It's weird, because that's kind of my final Christmas visit. Uh, and uh, it's only the 23rd at 4.54 p.m., so Christmas is kind of done for, for me. And there's still Christmas, even Christmas to go, so... Uh, I'm going to go home. I think Mom made some soup, so we're going to have that. And I do believe... Victoria, Steve, and I are going to go try to see Jumanji tonight, so we'll wait till we catch up with Steve before we end the video, but always good to see Andrew and uh, see his lovely house and his lovely family and some prizes. Those Ric Flair socks are great, huh? All right, talk to you in a bit. I've arrived home. Victoria just got home from work. She seems sad. Look, Tori, there's soup. Y'all ready for me to make the biscuits? I don't know, Mom. I don't know. Victoria said she wants to kick it. There's a package. Oh, is this? Ooh. Is it for me? It's the wonderful time where Victoria drives. Medical and spa. Oh, yeah. Medical spa? It's just right there. And we're going to see the movie. We're going to meet up with the seductive Steve at the movie. Um, Victoria, I heard we're going to see Jumanji, not this movie. But I heard because of the critical reception of Star Wars wasn't great, that on the second weekend, starting tomorrow, mm -hmm. they've inserted 25 minutes of Baby Yoda to, <laughs> to make the reception better. Does that please you or yes, displease you? Yes, yes, Or If you found out that it was one night showing tonight only. Well, let's go. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> We're going to see Jumanji. Um, yes. We're both very excited for that. And uh, when you see Steve, you going to touch him on his bottom? No! I am. It's yucky. Right at the... For watch cinemas. We saw Aquaman here. Yeah. Did we see Avengers here? We saw Infinity War at the at the other IMAX here. Yeah, we saw it here. We did see. We it. saw Endgame here. We saw Endgame here because we saw it the night yes, before. Yes, in the big recliner yeah. that we are actually going to go see Star Wars tomorrow. In, but the yeah. video will be over by then. Yeah. Do you like to pass gas in this? Currently, uh, we're the only three people seeing the movie tonight, <laughs> which is great. And if that happens, I'm going to de pants. Victoria, we've just learned that when you buy a popcorn here, they give you the popcorn and you bring it over there to the butter before you even give it to the popcorn guy. Which means you can fill the whole bucket up with butter <laughs> and then hand it to the popcorn guy. Just have Are you in on that? Floating. I don't know. Do you like how I'm shooting you on the on the edge of the frame like Sam asked me? Yes. Did you know there was a horse? <laughs> I told you. Ooh. Horse. That's the popcorn salt. You gotta shake it on there, Victoria. Here's our dust. Thank you very much. Thank you. Oh, yeah, see? So he hands it to you. So, Steve, you put a butter base, and then he gave you some corn. Uh -huh. And now you're buttering it again like a parfait. Uh -huh. Yep, and then you're gonna hand it back. And I mean, that's where it's at. Yeah. They're selling popcorn because of that. We gotta give it to you. Like, we can just fill this up with butter and dump it on top. No. And then you gotta butter it again. Oh, yeah. Oh, Stevia. Yeah. Oh, Stevia. Yeah. Sometimes you just gotta lube it up all nice and buttery. Take that figure bath, you know, dip the popcorn in it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll talk to you after the movie. I lied. Steve's got the popcorn on the package. This theater is actually very nice. It's pretty new. And the recliners are top notch. Hey, Sonic. Rub it. Steve, what did you think of the movie? And it was so good. I mean, so many laughs, so many joyful moments. Victoria, you? Yeah, very, very good. I think it was as good, if not better, than the uh, yeah. first one. I think it was great. Oh, put it in the bomb. Yeah, you know. Got to refill the slushy. Oh, there's one slushy that's not red, and it's a white cherry one. Whoo! So we all loved it. Yeah. And this is our end of this episode of Double Life. We can just, we can just stand out here in the lobby area conspicuously while everyone's looking. Are we the only people left in this entire movie theater? Yeah, there's some there's probably still there. somebody watching Star Wars. Yeah. Um. So Victoria. Yes. Should people go see Jumanji? Yeah. In the theater. Yeah, I yeah. think so. It's, it's worth really it. Fun. See it with your fun. friends. Laugh yeah. with your friends. I laughed a lot. A yeah. lot. I mean, that's what you need to do.
Yeah. Uh, yeah the, the first yeah. movie the, was such a surprise. Yes. And it was during uh, The Last Jedi was when that was out. Okay. And I think, right? It was that same Christmas. And we were, we loved it. Yeah. Yeah. And it was, we had Movie Pass at the time. Yeah. And uh, this time, during Star Wars again, and I'm sure it'll do really, I think it's already done monster numbers already. Just in the 10 days it's out. It doesn't feel like they'll, it feels like if they make a third, it won't be with The Rock. And it'll be, there's a post credits that felt like it could set it up for something different. Yeah. So I don't know how they do it again, but I didn't know, I didn't know yeah. how they do this one again. Yeah. And it was great. Yeah. Um, and you, and all the gags are not in the trailer. Like you're worried in this one that all the gags in the trailer certainly Here, not. Here's the ironic. Here's something ironic here, all right? Not that. So like usually game, usually movies based on video games are bad. Yeah. This is a movie based on a game that doesn't exist. And it's good. And it's, and it's really good. A completely ridiculous premise. Do you want to take some of that tile home, put it in your bathroom? No. Is it the ostriches from the game? <laughs> well, this is the end of our uh, video. It's Christmas Eve tomorrow. Steve's got to go home. Yeah. Uh, Victoria and I are going to do a lot of nothing. We're going to see Star Wars tomorrow, so we'll see. Yeah. But uh, it's been a good video. We've seen lots of good people. Has everybody enjoyed? Steve, yeah. have you enjoyed some Dub Life? We're going to see Victoria next episode as we go to Baltimore. Steve, the episode after that, as we are in a one year reunion of 35 Walmarts in 24 hours. <laughs> Who knows what we'll do? That's when seductive Steve really got seductive, yeah? So we've got to take it up this a level. The place of the we've got to add another descriptor. Oh dear. Like moist seductive Steve, huh? <laughs> All right, we'll talk to you next time. Give him a squeeze. Wow. Wow. Please, uh, so loud for the people behind us. Squeeze it. Woohoo!